Hello my viewers and welcome back to another unboxing, viewing and testing. But today is a curiosity day. That means I will disassemble this Parkside Performance Smart Battery 20V 8A and together we're gonna be smarter after this video. We're gonna find out together what parts it has inside and what type of cells and it can give us 20V 8A. I have made another two videos unboxing and viewing this uh, battery and testing. You can check this video down below to the description or in the end of this video. Don't miss these videos are very important because you're gonna find out how long it will last this battery drilling a good with a 14 millimeter diameter and seven centimeter length drill bit with a park site, of course, cordless drill. I was amazed by the performance. That's why I don't miss these videos. And let's move on now for disassembling this battery. Pressing this button, we can see we've got the red, yellow and green indicator is fully charged. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight screws, Allen screws, and let's start. Okay, we need to remove in these screws, another four. Okay, eight screws was removed. Perfect. Oh, wow. Two different plastics, side plastics. Here we have uh, the lock and lock switch with a button for the LED indicator. Wow, there is the Bluetooth module connecting to your smartphone. Wow, I can say are very well manufactured, are fitting very well everything. Well, I cannot move further to disassemble all this because even if I will remove these two screws, uh, the batteries are soldered at the main board. Now, the batteries inside are 21700 cells, are a new cells, compared with the 18650 cells, let me show you. Okay, there is the 18650 cell, let me show you the differences. You can see the 21700 cell at this battery, it is uh, with a bigger length, and definitely it has a larger diameter, as you can see. That means it has uh, more capacity. Nice. Well, I can say definitely it is very well manufactured, this battery. It gives you the idea that you have a premium product. Nice. There is the button for the LED indicators, green, yellow and red. The connections for any power tools. And we can see we've got four, eight, ten different cells. Nice. Here are the spots weldings on the battery with nickel strip. And to have 20 volt total, it starts with a positive ball, it goes at the negative, then positive. And again, uh, negative, positive, negative pole, positive, negative pole, positive, and it ends with a negative pole. And that's how it will give us 21 volts total when it's fully charged. We have three soldering connections here and another four here. One, two, three, four. Well, guys, that was all about. I like it. Definitely. I'm very happy the way that it looks inside but who cares let me say in that the only thing that you care the most it is to give you more power to work uh, longer but just to know guys how it looks your battery if you decide to buy this eight amber hours with a bluetooth connectivity 
Now you know, you are smarter and I hope you will enjoy this video. And I have made a video disassembling and the 4 amp hours battery and the 2 amp hours battery. You can check in this video down below in the description or in the end of this video. Well guys, that was all about. Let's start the assembly again. First it goes that here. And installing all the screws. Well guys, that was all about. Assembly was finished. I hope you have enjoyed this video. And until my next video, please subscribe, share this video, you never know who may need it, and hit the notification bell because more videos in the future are coming and you don't want to miss it. Have a nice and lovely day. Bye bye.